Recognize the member from Saskatchewan Rivers. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The people of Saskatchewan are telling me government isn't listening to them. Maybe the members will hear these words today. These are their stories. My grandmother told me this was how it started in the old country. I remember the hatred more than the hunger. My doctor was great, too bad he was driven away. My son cries himself to sleep every night for being bullied and isolated at school. How does a government decide who is worthy in society? Our children will not know freedom with digitalization. Vax the truckers and watch the supply chain shortage. Why does the Premier let that lady speak for him? What happened to a transparent and accountable government? How high will inflation go with so many businesses failing? <coughs> But what the government has failed to realize is that you cannot stop people from living and making their own choices. People are going to live their lives and assume the risks of living. The only thing being accomplished now is the mental and financial anguish of a people who have lost trust in the government and are, are there in pain and suffering. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.